Hello, Bedidlers. How are you diddling? Wishing you a very happy new year. Last time I left you, we were about to enter the end game. But first, shopping the bidder. Let us buy a little bit of spike protection because obviously, obviously we wasted some in uh, Yoku Man stage. Some pit rescue, don't mind if I do. And let's buy a final energy tank. We are ready to enter the final stages of the game. The qu and of course, select the question mark. If you select Yoku Man again, you'll just be doing that lovely stage all over. Okay, we enter the abandoned fortress. Looking a bit rough around the edges. Don't like the look of that skull. And as I think is quite logical, we start outside. Some nice pylons in the background there. Uh, I believe that the... Uh, I recall the developer saying the aesthetics are inspired by where he grew up in Canada. Now this stage, you know, throughout this uh, fortress, we are reintroduced to enemies that we've already encountered. Effectively, it's testing us, do you remember how they work? The mines from Pac-Man stage, the stomping enemy, uh, we first encountered it in Glue Man stage, and the missile droppers, quite a nuisance from uh, Jetman stage. And the Red Guardian, that we first encountered in Glue Man stage as well. Now the electric electricity in the background uh, from the pylons, don't worry about that, that can't hurt you, just ignore it. And the missile droppers very much can. Now so far we've done quite well, so we don't need to pick up that energy up there. Now to show you the weapon that we got from Yoku Man, the Yoko attack Bediddler. It homes in and kills stuff effectively. As you can see, very good for enemies like this up here. Now there's a ladder up there and you're quite right, we used a rush coil to get up there. And if you said that, you'd actually be quite wrong. You don't use a rush coil to get up there, it doesn't go high enough. You have to very carefully use the glue shot, and it requires precision, because if you do this, for example, uh, well, you, 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 you've messed up. You have to try again. You've got to be specific, precise about placing it. There you go, and that's how you do that bit. Of course, if you keep messing that up, you'll run out of glue, shit, glue, glue shot, and uh, you will have to try again and by try again I mean you'll have to get more glue shot and this section requires rush jet a lot of forced weapon uses in in this uh, in this stage so energy conservation you know energy conservation I sound very environmentally friendly don't I is key and I nearly jumped on that spike but so far, we haven't really encountered anything too drastic. A uh, stomping enemy. We can kill it. Ooh. Knocked me down to the uh, previous level. I'm quite angry with that stomping enemy. So let's wait for it to get closer. And use the yo-yo cutter. Lovely. And uh, we got some weapon energy for that. So it was worth it. Now, this is the trouble. Oh, there's just a gap there and a spike in the background. In the uh, further away, rather. What do we do? You are going to need Russia here again. And of course, if you run out of it, well, you'll probably fall to your death. And if you do that, you're going to. That is why these enemies are here, these tele enemies. You will need to farm them and uh, try it again. Off we go. Don't worry about the copters, they will not f aim at you. Pick up the energy. There we go, that's the first part. Off we go again.
and I was a little bit distracted there because it occurs to me that those um, circular objects on uh, stilts they have a very interesting aesthetic I think you'll agree they definitely don't look anything a bit dodgy at all goodness me okay so that's that section it's fairly short but it does take some memorization for sure but once you complete it checkpoint if you fall to your death you're going back to the beginning of the level Sunny Jim right part two of the stage we didn't play as tremendously well so let's get a bit of energy here can we do it niftily well no we missed for one thing and we fall back down again you could see actually the attention to detail of course we're uh, yeah, the fortress is uh, cracked and nonsense on the outside and cracks have appeared on the inside as well very nice detail ah oh, that was not very uh, that was not nifty at all a cruel spike there I think we would like to fill up rush jet here of course if you remember correctly don't forget to use your weapons trinitro blast kills the shields in one hit and that's a nice thing to do but it's expensive of course some awkward jumps a little bit more weapon energy if you require it do we require it uh, not really and uh, another red guardian ah see we could I didn't actually need to buy that extra energy tank. I could have actually uh, got it here. Nicely done. Now what they want you to do is use these nail man platforms, if you remember those, to go all the way up to the top and then fall down again. But of course, if you can't be bothered to do that, you can do a nifty glue shop. <laughs> like that. But we don't need the uh, we don't need that energy tank, so we're just going to skip it with blithe disregard do you remember how the nailman platforms work if you do no trouble if you don't you'll probably fall off several times and feel like a big Egypt in the process so there you go that little uh, you drop down there to eventually get the uh, energy tank right now if you were paying attention you should have recalled there was actually a gap in the spikes and that is where you need to shift to the left as you drop to grab onto the ladder but not too soon that you drop into spikes or too late that you drop into those spikes so caution and observation is advised here if you go up too fast that met will nail you with its laser gun and you'll probably drop down again screen shocker Kill it immediately. I mean, that's a tricky jump. Could use Comet Dash or the uh, Rush Jet to uh, make it easier. A little bit of weapon energy here. Let's refill that Nitro Blast we used. Right. It's raining. It's thundering. Things are getting serious. Hopefully the uh, recording is uh, coping with this. Right. Rush Jet again. Off we go. Be bold. Be brave. You're doing it for civilization. Be sure to step off to refill. Of course, the fact is, I know the layout of this stage well. If you don't, I mean, which you won't when you first play it, you could hesitate. You could, uh, you know, you're going to have more trouble with it. And, uh,. You will miss uh, energy pickups, which is not good. The next section here, we do not need the rush yet, although you might want to use it to play it safe. These uh, tellies can be annoying, which is why I have the nail shield to um, deal with them accordingly. Now for a fancy move. Oh, that jump is certainly a very nerve wracking, but uh, you can do it. I have faith in you to do so. We're very nearly at the end of the level. Just one more drop and here we go. Now you remember the uh, tri-nitro fluid from tri-nitro man stage 
instant kill. Needless to say, don't jump into it. And we're starting to see the screen scroll. I wonder what- Oh my goodness me! And I died like an absolute fool. Even though I knew that was coming. Yes. Should we try that again? Right. You need to be faster than I was there. There is a crab! It looks like it's got a keyboard for a bat. Right. We are going to use the weakness for this bediddler. Because it's quite irritating. Week two. Oh no, get off the ladder! Oh my goodness, that was close. Now, I recommend probably staying in the center. Use the nail shield when it fires those electric balls at you. And uh, as you can see, it shocks ladders. If you're on a ladder, it shocks. And you don't get off, you will fall off the ladder. And you will almost certainly fall into the pit. And there we go. Goodness me. So yes, weakness, jet missile. Use the nail shield as well. That's a good combination, I find. A hectic boss, I think. Now, quite difficult if you don't use the weakness. But uh, for these fortress bosses, I will be using the weakness. The weaknesses. But of course, feel free not to. Right, that's the first stage done. It was very enjoyable. I liked it. But we now come to, I think this next stage um, might be my favourite of the fortress stages. But to see this place in more detail, well I'm afraid you're going to have to wait until the next part. Thank you very much for watching and I look forward to seeing you next time.